got some tips for keystrokes that I've been trying to work into my editing this week. The first one is the ability to select a clip without using the mouse, that is pressing Shift and V. Once you've got your clip selected, you press Option and then using the up and down arrows to move either up a track or down a track. And that's particularly useful if you are doing it in combination with the slip and slide that we looked at before because it allows you to select a clip and then you can take that clip to another track and move it around. This is important because when you do the uh, slipping along the timeline, sliding along the timeline I should say, then that can actually, when it touches another clip, grab onto it and pull it out as you move. Now if you're on the same track as another clip, that can be a little bit frustrating. It also means that you can actually delete through other clips as you move. If you want to avoid that, you can select the clip using Shift V, move it up or down a track, and then you can shift it around uh, to where you want it to be. It means that you're not having to reach for the mouse and it gets you around the fact that that will grab onto the other clips. There are a number of different ways we can manipulate clips when we're looking at moving them around next to each other. And I'm gonna have a look at those next time, but those are more mouse focused rather than something that you would do just with the keyboard. <laughs> 